the Virgil. Your Excellency, weren't you supposed to be looking for our colleagues? Indeed. I regret to say that they are indeed all dead. I knew it. What a waste. Eugenia and her recklessness are to blame for this. I'm afraid someone else is responsible for this. These deaths are not accidental, and yet they were disguised as such. The savages! Their thirst for blood is unquenchable. I knew we should never have come without an escort. Watch your tongue, priest. Our people have no need to hide when they protect their land. Only the Renaigze are deceitful enough to disguise a death. Who else could it be? Someone who desperately wanted this expedition to fail. Does that remind you of anyone? Fine. You unmasked me. But know that my cause is righteous. The Ordo Luminous sent me to keep an eye on this expedition, to ensure that the discoveries we made would not jeopardize our nation or our presence on this island. But the inscriptions on the tablets are a heresy, a dangerous manipulation. Can you imagine what would happen if it was said that our founder listened to the teachings of the natives? But even then, foolish Eugenia accepted these discoveries as truth, without any hesitation, without realizing that our entire nation could suffer because of it. So yes, I wanted to scare her. I understand that you might want to protect your nation, but to go as far as assassinating several of your colleagues. Come now. What would you do if someone were threatening the congregation? You cannot make me believe that you would not be willing to kill. You may have already done so, but since you want to avoid using violence, help me convince Eugenia to go back to Eden. My colleagues and I know how to sort through these discoveries. And you will be rewarded, of course. This Renaigse tried to blame my people for these crimes. The priests would have wanted to punish them, and innocent people would have died. He must answer for his treachery. It is undeniable that these discoveries could cause a great upset in Taleme. But he has no right to decide what should be revealed or not. On this island, Cornelia should be the one to decide. Be careful with your accusations, though. Eugenia and her colleagues are on edge. We wouldn't want them to start killing each other. It seems to me that all members of this expedition are concerned. They should decide on what to do next. Everybody listen. Alas, I must inform you that I have found the dead bodies of your missing colleagues. Oh, how awful. What happened to them? Someone wanted us to believe that they were killed by some swamp animals, but it was all staged. Your colleagues were murdered, and their bodies abandoned to the creatures. What? But why do such a thing? And who murdered them? Brother Virgil confessed to his crimes in front of me. Monster! You will pay for these crimes. These people you killed were our brothers. Our friends. You stupid goose. You really believe that I will let you pass judgment on me? You shouldn't have been so quick to accept these lies that could destroy our nation and want to reveal them for all to hear. You are solely responsible for these deaths. How dare you present yourself as the protector of our nation? Murderer! May the enlightened protect me in this battle! Do you think you can play so Yeah! 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 
sorry, sister. Brother Virgil fled during the battle. Oh, the coward. And naturally, his accomplices fled along with him. Oh, what a waste. So many people died. Perhaps I shouldn't have revealed his crimes in front of everyone. But I thought it was the best way of ensuring he would be judged. Considering how high tensions have been these last few days, a fight was inevitable, alas. But you did what you thought was fair. Here. Take this. As a token of gratitude for shedding light on these dismal events. Alas. We will have to go back to Eden as well. There are too few of us to continue the research. Were you hoping to discover more? Of course. This place was but a single step in St. Matthias's journey. The last tablets speak of a journey northbound, further up in the swamp. But even if Virgil is no longer a threat, we are not sufficiently well equipped to go there. We could go there for you if you wish. You just have to tell us where to look. That would be marvelous. Of course, you would have to start from the excavation site where he wrote this. I think I noticed a path going north when I was there, actually. Look for any traces of life. Perhaps you will be lucky enough to find more of his writings. That would be fantastic. Don't worry. I will conduct this research and come find you here if I uncover anything.
like you protect me in this battle.
this when they want to live away from the world. Let's take a closer look at these paintings. We may learn something from them. This mural depicts an old man praying in front of a face in the mountain. He's holding a rosary. Saint Matthias. Praying to Enon Miel Fructiman. This mural is very ancient. It depicts an old man dressed as a priest getting his face painted by a masked native. There are some native symbols here, and some letters I recognize, as if someone had tried to write in the native language using our alphabet. Men duis dat, enon mil fricdemen. It means, welcome us amongst your people, enon mil fricdemen. This is incredible. Saint Matthias would have known about the spirit of the island and would have... prayed to him. It looks like a chaplet made of pewter. It's rather basic, but it was made a long time ago, and it undeniably comes from the continent. This is incredible. Saint Matthias is often depicted or described as using a similar chaplet. Oh, I feel so lucky to be here. In this cavern where our founder lived. Engraved tablets. They resemble the ones we recovered in Eden. We should take them with us. The researchers would be delighted to study them. I don't know these glyphs, but these spirals are native symbols. There are some words in our ancient language next to them. The light and the earth are the two faces of the same power. It's impossible to know if this is a translation or another sentence. But this is a message that would seriously displease the Inquisitors. I cannot believe it. These symbols, they are signs used in the secret writing of the Donegada. I don't know if you realize the importance of what we've just discovered. Saint Matthias, the founder of Teleme, finished his life worshipping the Islander's God. 
This is so incredible. Although it will cause a huge upset for our nation, our cult, and our relations with the natives. I wonder what I should do with these relics. Eugenia probably didn't imagine that Saint Matthias lived his life in a way that's so different from what they advocate. As for Virgil, he wasn't wrong. Such a revelation will certainly cause a schism in Teleme. I understand you must be concerned. Great revelations are often followed by a trail of blood. But if what we found was revealed, my people could live in peace with the priests at last. I already took sides in their quarrel. If I change my mind, I'm afraid that it might be seen as treason. I'll think about it on the way there. Let's go back to the researchers' camp. So, did you find anything? Or do you need my help? We discovered a cave that was inhabited a long time ago by a whole group of people, mostly natives, who had obviously created a sacred site, as the place was guarded by a creature. And have you found traces of our holy founder? New relics? Perhaps some tablets? There were also frescoes on the site, representing St. Matthias. Frescoes? Tell me more. This is fascinating. He was shown having his face painted by a native. On the other, he prayed to a god of the mountain. You... you can't be serious. You mean to say that our saint converted to the cult of the islanders? That is what emerges from our findings, yes. Other objects that I was able to bring back also point in this direction. Look. There are inscriptions. These tablets and also this chaplet. This chaplet? I cannot believe it. It is so... Excuse me. I cannot find the words to express how I feel. You must come with me. We must go and present all these discoveries to the Mother Cardinal. You realize our entire dogma will have to change. So far, Anyone who wanted to question it would have burned their fingers. Literally, alas. And you think that this time they'll listen? We have solid proof. All this evidence. With your support, we will convince her to reveal the truth. I see. I will do my best to help you. It seems we are arriving right on time. You did well to warn us, Brother Virgil. Virgil? How did you know? I'm afraid that Your Excellency's lies weren't very convincing. We were informed of your discoveries and of the danger they represent. We demand that you hand them over to us immediately, so that they can be destroyed. How can you even suggest the destruction of relics written by the hand of our founder? Out of love for our dogma, for our faith, and for our nation. But since you refuse to comply with our orders, you leave us no choice. Death to the heretics! Maybe in life you can take me in this battle! <laughs>
did you find? We discovered a cave, mostly native. And have you found? There were also frescoes. Frescoes? He was shown. You. That is what emerged. Look. This chaplain. Excuse me. You must come. You realize so far. And you think that this. We have solid proof. I see. It seems we are. And we we have out, but since then. Maybe I'm watching. Let's see. 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 Let's see.